Good afternoon guys. Today is not such a beautiful day in Vegas, which is surprising. It rained a tiny bit yesterday actually, but there were still clear skies. Look at this though. <laughs> it's raining. You can't see it on the camera, I guess. Look at the clouds and there's absolutely nobody in the pool. Hold on, it's gone blurry. Ah. So yeah, it's definitely not the nicest of days, but we're gonna find stuff to do. I think we wanna head down to like the MGM Grand, Mandalay Bay, which I'm excited about because that's where the UFC fights are held and New York, New York maybe, but I don't know because we probably won't be able to go on the roller coaster today at New York, New York because it's raining like this. Either way, I'm sure we'll still find lots to do. Oh my God. And we were watching the news before actually and they were saying there's flash flood warnings for Clark County, wherever that is. I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, it's going to be a good day. Um, I made Friday's vlog public finally and I'm going to be making Saturday's vlog public later today. And then I've just got to do yesterday's edit. So I'm doing pretty well with it, especially considering we've been staying out till like three in the morning most nights. Anyway, we're going to use our $18 credit to try to buy some breakfast style food or something right now. Despite the fact it's raining, I still reckon it's going to be a great day in Vegas. Especially the female ones, obviously. But yeah, Emma and Kylie need a makeup brush because they lost or forgot theirs. I think they lost it. It's so nice in here. Everything's so shiny and bright and it smells really good. This place is expensive. The brush Emma's gonna get is um, $38 and everything I'm looking at is like $35. But I suppose people are willing to pay it. I'm glad I don't use any of this stuff. Actually, I want to though, so I wanna do my makeup a little bit more and stuff. We'll see what happens. It's a nice store. Emma ended up getting some bronzer and the brush. How much was it? $61? $62? Expensive, but uh, that's to be expected. We are in M&M heaven. I cannot wait to see the other floors. There's four floors and I haven't even seen any actual M&Ms yet. Too much choice, but at the same time, it is incredible. Yeah, Look at these huge ones. Pull the handle very really slow with that one the So many pretty colors. That's enough. What is it? How much was it? 
$1.82. Only $1.82, that was much cheaper than the makeup. I got a souvenir penny, it only cost me 51 cents. I'm pretty sure I got one of the zoo ones, and that cost me like $3 or $2, so bargain. We're about to watch some 10 minute thing, and obviously by the glasses it's 3D, but they're the most uncomfortable 3D glasses that I've ever worn. But it should be good. Look, the M&M's down there, Dan. Yeah. MGM Grand. I'm excited to check this place out. They've got like the Rainforest Cafe. Looks really cool. Look at that. And it's nice. It's so cool being able to go to all these different casinos and see different things. Like, it's such an experience. I just saw a post up at UFC 178 and it's actually being held here at the MGM Grand. But the reason I want to go to Mandalay Bay is because it's where the last few UFC events have been held or where my favorite UFC fighters have last fought so that's why I want to go there. I just turned $1 into $5 on the roulette machine that's about how much I bet. Um, I'm stingy but I just won $4 that's pretty good. It's a good machine I like it. So I put it back in and I've got $10 now so I've won $9. Big spender. I think I want to play more though. We'll see. It's only a dollar if I lose everything, so why not? I ended up getting like $23, $24 up and then I lost it all. I went on a huge losing streak. But that's okay because I only lost one dollar, so that's not so bad. Oh, We're going into the Excalibur now. We've visited a lot of casinos today and it's good because you've seen all different stuff, especially on a day like today where it's not as hot. Um, so we can walk around a lot and we saw in and out and we're going to be going there for dinner probably. Emma and Kylie tried it. Emma says it's awesome so I'm looking forward to it. And I'm looking forward to seeing Mandalay Bay soon. We're going into Excalibur like I said. And look at this, there's a travelator that goes into the, into the casino. Wow, laziness at its peak. Mandalay Bay and look how incredible it all is. Yeah, my sister just said it's the most beautiful entrance. I disagree. I reckon the Venetian still is, but this is like really, really, really fancy and awesome. Just the level of opulence that you see in Vegas is mind blowing. It's it's so good. I love this place so much. I just saw a guy that I know from a YouTube channel. I don't think I'm subscribed to him anymore, but he does a lot of GoPro videos. I didn't want to go up and say hello to him because I don't really remember his name or anything like that, but it was crazy to see someone I knew. I might try to find his Twitter later and tweet him that I saw him at Mandalay Bay. The interior of Mandalay Bay is definitely the most fancy out of any of the hotels. Look at this. Ridiculously fancy. I really like it here, especially because my favorite UFC fighters have fought here before, and that makes me so happy. The Mandalay Bay pool is incredible. This whole place is probably the best casino and hotel in Vegas that I've seen so far. The Venetian still wins, hands down, for exterior, but everything in here is just ridiculous. I love it so much, and it's not even just because my favorite UFC fighters have fought here, it's actually because it's just incredible.
love the exterior of this one because it's got like the Statue of Liberty and the roller coaster and stuff but the interior is really cool as well. I think we'll have to hit up that Hershey's chocolate store later but for right now I think we're going to maybe do a bit of gambling and if the roller coaster is running, which I'm not sure if it is because it was raining, then we'll go on that. So it should be good. by walking so we're gonna find somewhere else to eat dinner and we're going to Caesars and our hotel to gamble again. an extra McChicken at the end of when we finished eating. It was only a dollar and eight cents. In Australia, that would be at least four or five dollars. That's crazy to me. I can't believe it. We're back in the room. It's early in the morning, like three. So we're gonna go to bed. We've had a good day. We explored so much today. Saw some really awesome things. So yeah, hopefully tomorrow's just as good. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you're doing well. Take care and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.